did you find, are there systemic problems? Is this a one-off with Nickelodeon or certain shows? How big does this go in that industry? Yeah, I think people would say it's systemic, right? Because at the end of the day, what you have are children who want opportunities and people who are in positions to make that happen or block that from happening. It was interesting, and experts have said, and I thought this was fascinating, that you know we hear about grooming of children, right? I've heard that a lot. But they talked about grooming of parents too, because in many cases, as it showed in the documentary, the series, parents were very there, and in some cases, very, very involved. But, you know, first, the people who are pedophiles try to, or predators, try to befriend the parents, right? If that doesn't work, then you try to drive a wedge between the parent and the kid. And if you're talking about Hollywood kids, right, they're all these tweens or teenagers trying to get more independent, trying to get more power, et cetera, et cetera, like any teenager. And therefore, you can see, like, they're open to being, you know, torn apart from their parents. So as I was watching that doc, I thought, like, this is this is set up to be terrible for the kids, right? It's set up to have predators take advantage. Is the solution to have the legislature deal with this, to have um, sag after deal with this, um, or self-regulation? What's the solution here? My guess would be probably all of the above. But one thing that was interesting to me was to see that when Brian Peck, um, uh, who was convicted of, of molesting Drake Bell, right, when he got out of prison, he got a job working at Disney. There were there were producers who vouched for him so he could go on and be employed. Like, that's a loophole that needs to be closed, right? I, I think any sane person would say that person should not be working around children. I also think you have to have self-monitoring of these of these networks. Again, whenever money is involved, and we've all had these, you and I, all three of us have had this conversation on different topics, right? Yeah. Money just makes people blind to, to yeah. things that are going wrong often. And so you often have to have layers of checks and balances, right? So that one person doesn't say, ah, oh, well, it's making money. Let's leave it alone. You know, that you actually have to hold people accountable.